Hey, what's up, guys? Gigi Khan back with another video on the top MIUI 6 tracks. So, without any further ado, let's go into the video. Starting with the first is a MIUI search. You can swipe up and you can type whatever you want to search, like Google, and you'll get the Google Apps here. You can also search that keyword in the internet. Coming to the next feature is the Do Not Disturb feature. You can enable that in settings and in the do not disturb feature. You can enable this recurring do not disturb time and you can set the time in which your phone will be kept in do not disturb mode. You can set that and go back and keep your phone happily in the pocket. The do not disturb feature means that your phone will be kept in silence whenever you get calls and notifications. And the next one is the automatic saving of the apk files. You can enable that just by going down to the settings and going down to the app store then you'll find a option like delete the package after installing just disable that so whenever you download any apps or games from the play store those files will be saved in your phone and you can install or you can share those files to your friends so that they can also install the games or the application you can just get that apk file just by downloading an app called ES File Explorer. Go to the home page and just tap on the app and here you will be able to see all the apk files of your phone. So that's a good feature by MIUI. And the next feature is the emergency torchlight feature. You can just enable that in the lock screen itself. So it will turn into the lock screen and we will open the screen. And just by tapping on the home button, you'll get your phone LED lit up. And I'll again show you. So we'll tap on the home button and you'll see that the phone has lit up. So it depends on how much you keep on the home button. And the next one is a notification feature. You can double tap on the app to get whichever notification the app has to give you. So that's a good feature and you can get it for almost any apps. Moving on is a camera feature. You can tap on anywhere on the screen to focus and you can just circle anti-clockwise or clockwise and just tap on that camera to get the photo and you'll get that in the gallery app like this. And the next one is a new iPhone like task manager. You can pinch in and pinch out to resize the task manager and you can see which all screens are on right now like this and accordingly you can tap on to any of the screen to get into that app and this feature is only available in MIUI 6 and the next one is the disabling of the capacitive keys you can just you can just disable that by scrolling down to the not get the notification toggle and just tap on that disable icon you see there and you'll find that the navigation button is disabled so you'll see that it is not working anymore and to fix that again just tap on the power button and the home button together like this so you can see that it is enabled again and it is working and the next one is the lock screen feature you can just turn off your screen and swipe from the right to left to get into the camera easily. You can just tap anywhere to focus and take the camera. So this is an emergency camera taking shortcut. Wondering how you can make your phone screen smaller so that you can access every part of the screen? It's simple. Just swipe from the home to the right and home to the left like this. Ah. And you can use your phone in a smaller screen like this and you can set it manually to 3.5 inch or 4 inches and this is called the one hand dead mode. It's a good app for people having small hands. You can go back just by swiping from the home to the left or wherever you have placed your screen. So that's pretty much it. If you enjoyed this video, do give this video a huge thumbs up and do subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. This is Geeky Khan signing off.